Welcome to a special episode of Chit Chat with Jerry Mahoney. Today we're going to be meeting the lads that I sometimes refer to in these videos. Yeah, yeah, the lads. They're friends of Jerry here. And uh, these are the lads that I've collected over the past, oh, I don't know, six, seven months since I started collecting these particular figures. So let's go ahead and start with the first two. We have Jerry Mahoney on the left, who is the original Jerry that I got when I was a kid at 10 years old. I kept him all these years. I've always thought he was a wonderful companion. And when we saw another figure on eBay that looks just like him, we had to have him. So Jerry Mahoney two and Jerry Mahoney. All right, so let's look at Danny O'Day. He's next. He would be Jimmy Nelson's ventriloquist dummy and or figure. And he uh, came to us from Georgia. He was actually at a yard sale that was purchased. I like to talk to the owners of these figures that I buy from eBay. Sometimes they have stories about them, sometimes they don't. And this Danny O'Day, when he came, he was a bit dusty and he didn't have any uh, good shoes, so we bought him a nice pair of tennis shoes, and we cleaned up his clothes, and we ironed his clothes, and he's in good shape. Our next little dummy is from 1973, a Willy Talk, owned by Bill Surratt in Missouri, and Bill buys and sells these little figures, and he kept this one cleaned up, and um, he was an interesting little guy, so we had to buy him as well. These figures, if I haven't mentioned, range anywhere from $30 to $50, somewhere in that range, if you're ever interested in beginning to become a collector. All right, next is Charlie McCarthy, and of course, this is Edgar Bergen's famous, the most famous ventriloquist figure, Charlie McCarthy, and he was $54. He came from Minnesota. He was in a collection of a woman's grandmother, or mother, I should say. Stephanie Gutzman sold this little figure to me, and her mother had had this figure for about 25 years on display in her home, so he is in a nice, safe home now, and we're happy to have him. And then finally, we have Mortimer Snurd, and Mortimer is a friend of Charlie McCarthy, also part of Edgar Bergen's act. Now, uh, Mortimer came to us in bad shape. He only had a red vest on, none of his clothes. Uh, he didn't have good clothes. He did have some pants, but they were starting to fray a little bit. So we went out to uh, purchase some clothes for him, and he wears a size 12 baby clothes, and he looks great. Doesn't he look great? We're going to purchase a hat for him to finish off the, the look for Mortimer Snurd. So uh, come on back here to check us out here. So Jerry, what did you think about that? Yeah, yeah, it is, it's a lot of fun. These are great guys. And of course, Jerry was a little bit more expensive. He's a semi-professional figure. Uh, you can imagine he'd be several hundred dollars. So if you really get into this stuff, you can have a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, I'm totally worth it though. Yes, you are. All right, well, thanks everybody. I hope you enjoyed seeing the lads today and we'll see you next time on Chit Chat with Jerry Mahoney. Yeah, yeah.